<clears throat> Hi. Um, William Harper Adley Giergis Jackson Pollock Hoffman Beauregard Crane Pool the third, but you can call me Juniper. Um, or or Melodious Wind Chime. Or Chico's winning lottery ticket. This is Chico. Uh, my girlfriend calls him the philosopher, but I think she's giving too much credit. I mean, you know, he doesn't he doesn't contemplate existence, you know, or mortality, or or racism, or misogyny. I mean, he thinks that Me Too is about oh, y'all y'all have an In and Out Burger. Well, come on, motherfuckers, Me Too. The, hey, baby, can you give me some water? Um, anyway, Chico, he's, he's, he's just a dog, right? I mean, he's my friend, you know, he's, he's my, he's my very good friend, but, uh, Chico don't know anything about, about Netflix, or, or gender fluidity, or, or no carb cauliflower pizza, you know, or, or how big an asshole Donald Trump is. Here you go, Big Pimpin. Thank you, baby. Well, this is my girlfriend. Uh, she calls me Big Pimpin sometimes. It's ironic. It's not ironic. Daddy throw down between the sheets. Um. Anyway. Um. Uh, so the reason why I'm making this tape is, uh, well, here it goes. Uh, I'm I'm psychic. And. Uh, that means that I I can see things. I can I can tell the future. Uh, I, I help the police solve a murder once, and uh, sometimes I, I help people, which is why I'm contacting you. Um, there's a there's a thing called the coronavirus, and I'm going to contract it, meaning that I'm going to get the virus, and it's gonna it's gonna kill me. I mean, I'm, 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 I'm healthy now. I'm, I'm Chico's Lord and Master. I'm, I'm big pimping between the sheets. But in a few days, I'm gonna get the virus, and it's gonna end up killing me. Um. So right now, you are in your mommy's tummy on a bus, and. Uh, you know, your your mother and I, we were high school sweethearts, and she visited recently, and she talked to my girlfriend and I, and she said she wanted to have a, a baby before she was too old, and well, I guess she's going to have one, and it's going to be you, and you know, your daddy, and your father, but uh, I'm not going to be here, so I just wanted to tell you uh, just a few things, and I, I, I wrote them down. Actually, and I and I, I know what you're thinking. I mean, if he's a psychic, why well, he's got to write that down? And I think I get that a lot. But um, I guess, oh, well, I guess I uh, I wrote it down because this is my only chance to to say some things to you, my son. So uh, these are just a, a, a few things that that folks told me that I'm real glad they did, as as well as a a few things no one ever told me that I. I wish they had. So here it goes. Number one, I love you. Number two, I love you. Number three, I love you so much. Number four, when you're young, don't be afraid to fight a bully. Because you really can't get hurt that bad, and sometimes you gotta bully the bully. Number five, do not tell mommy that I told you about number four. Number six, go to the gym. But real strength is empathy, and real manliness is compassion, especially compassion for people that you hate, like Donald Trump. Uh, number seven, Practice revolutionary optimism. Mary Barack said that. Number eight, 
You never lose by being generous. And your grandfather, William Harper, Adley, Gigas, Jackson, Pollock, Harper, Beauregard, Crane, Poole the second said that, but his friends called him Maurice. Number nine, all the shit that they tell you when you're young is actually true. And you won't do most of it, but with kindness, brushing your teeth, and doing the hardest things first, those are the ones that I prioritize. And lastly, number 10. Okay. Um, there is a disease called more. Fuck more. Find someone you love and something you love to do and don't give up and don't look back. Don't be like me, some be like you. Okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. <clears throat>